Hello everyone, welcome back to my kitchen. So today we are going to be making a sweet Hawaiian chicken served over rice. And before we dive into today's recipe, if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. And to all the returning viewers, thank you for your support. Your comment and likes mean the world to me. So let's grab our aprons and let's get started. For our Hawaiian chicken, we're going to need some boneless, skinless thighs, or you can use chicken breasts, some pineapple juice, some salt and pepper, and your favorite barbecue sauce. Okay, so we have our chicken thighs right here, so we're going to put these in a bowl. And the thing that's really nice about this dish is it's so few ingredients and there's going to be very little cleanup to be done because we are going to cook this in a crock pot. So, all right, so the first thing we want to do is we're going to sprinkle a little salt and pepper on this. And then we're going to give this a good toss before we move over to getting everything ready in the crock pot. And as always, being we are working with raw meat, we do want to make sure and um, wash our hands when we're done. Because we don't need to be getting sick. <laughs> or salmonella or whatever. So, there we go. So, we've got this all coated with our salt and pepper. So, let's move over to the, let's go ahead and grab our crock pot. And we're going to get this dish continued. Alright, so we have everything together that we need. So we are going to pour in our favorite barbecue sauce into our crock pot. Everything out of here. And now we're going to add in our pineapple juice. Trying not to make a mess. For a change, I was not able to make a mess, so that's good. <coughs> So once we got that in there, we're going to go ahead and get this um, barbecue sauce and pineapple juice all blended up. We want to get that all smooth because it's going to need to coat all of our chicken. And as you can see, it's all looking nice and smooth. So to this, we are going to now add in our chicken. I could have easily just dumped it in here, but you know, with my luck, I would have made a mess, meaning I didn't make one earlier. I'm gonna give this a stir while we're doing all this. Make sure we get this coated. That's looking good. It smells really good too. So now we're going to put a lid on this, and this is going to go, if you put this on high, we're looking at about three hours or so, and if you do it on low, you're probably looking at a good four to six hours or until the meat is pork tender. So we're going to throw a lid on it and let it cook. All right, so our chicken has been going for a good three hours. And as we can see, everything looks good. Away. So what we're going to do is we're going to get us some rice. Set that right here in the middle of our bowl. We're going to get us a couple of good pieces of chicken. And as you can see, it's already starting to fall apart. So it is perfect. Give 
just a little bit more. And there we go. So I hope everyone enjoyed the video. As always, I appreciate the love and the comments and the likes and the videos, I mean, sorry, the um, views. And as always, remember, be nice and be kind. And also, enjoy cooking in the kitchen. And until next time.